people behind the church. Over here is the chapel. And you see the um, European version. And you see the, um, now you see over there the um, Virgin Mary and the baby. Oh, let me start there. We are at Our Lady's Chapel. And we have the image of the Madonna and Child, who's Mary and Jesus. And with the spread of Christianity by the Roman Catholics, Aset and Haru were changed to the white Jesus and Mary and the, and the black Madonna and Child. These two icons were both able to coexist. While the Christians would paint and create sculptures of the image more to look like white people, paintings and sculptures were found of the black Madonna and child as the Nubians or black people. The paintings and images of black Madonna and child have been found in Poland, Spain, Russia as Our Lady. Images of black Madonna Black Diana have been found in Notre Dame and images of her as Our Lady are found in Rome and of course throughout Africa. Her religion or cult, short for culture, still spread through the world as you will see on this on this tour through Washington DC and Maryland. So right now we're out here behind the church with the Madonna and Child, the European version, um, and we're at Our Lady's Chapel to let you know we're tracing the origins of the Black Madonna, the Madonna and Child. We're tracing the origins of the Madonna and Child, and the Archbishop John Cow was the first pastor of St. John's Church. Father John Cowell would later become perfect apostle, the first bishop of the United States, and first archbishop, archbishop of Baltimore. He founded jo Georgetown University and St. John's Evangelistic School, which is right over here. Over here is the St. John's Evangelistic School. So right now we're showing the relationship of school and religion as religion influence the um, academic world. So right now we're getting ready to go over to Rosen Steel's Street Avenue to go see the old church where the Black Madonna and Child is at.